Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's me, James Rule XRP. Follow me at Twitter at Rule XRP. Let's get into this. Fiat leak. XRP is at 0.263. It was at 27 cents earlier. There may have been a little bit of sell-off, but we are still holding 26.39. Looking good. This is fiatleak.com slash XRP. And everything I cover today, I will put in the description below so you can check it out yourself. I am not a financial advisor. This is for entertainment purposes only. All right, let's go to XRP stats. This is ledger.exposed XRP rich list stats. And this page was created by Vitsewin. And he actually set this up where you can kind of monitor XRP wallets and look and see where you stand compared to the rest of the world. And this <clears throat> range is from May 9th, 2020 to today, which is August 1st, 2020. And it shows you a trend of accounts and how the growth in XRP per individual is increasing so if you look here in the 3000 xrp range which if you have 3025 xrp you are an xrp 10 percenter you're 10 percent the 10 percent that have xrp and look look at this rise this is unbelievable five percent ten thousand four hundred forty and these wallet totals have gone up and as there's more adoption in the world, in the banks, in the U.S., and everything else, these totals are going to increase. It is going to get to a point to be a 10 percenter. This number will increase dramatically. And as you go up the ranks, you see the balances increase. It shows you what percent percentile or what range you're in compared to others let's click on by number of accounts and i've explained this before the 0 to 19 xrp are using wallets that are set up on uh whenever you set up an xrp wallet at whether it be on a, a ledger nano x or ledger nano s you have to have a 20 xrp reserve and that is required so that whenever you make your trans or whenever you set it up, the XRP ledger knows that you're not a bot or something else. It knows that you're legit because you actually funded that wallet. And as you can see from 20 to 499 XRP, there are 1.3 million XRP wallets in this range. And as the numbers go up, you see that there are less number of accounts as the increase in balance. And a lot of these top wallets here, some are Ripple and a lot are exchanges like Coinbase and Uphold and BitTrue, I Trust Capital. They have to keep a substantial amount of XRP in their wallets so that the public may purchase XRP. And a lot of these top wallets are exchanges. Let's click on the top. As you can see, four, no, I'll take that back. Five of these top accounts are owned by Ripple. There's one unknown here, and two of these are exchanges, Binance and BitBank. Let's go back. Let's check out the next set. Coin check. three unknown, to Ripple, Kraken, Exchange. All right, let's go back one more time. And I'm just showing you this. I'll leave a link in the description below. 53 accounts. Huobi, Ripple, Bitfinex, CoinOne, and a lot of these are individuals, unknowns. Binance, Crypto, BTC Markets. And it, it shows you <clears throat> the, the by number of accounts. You know, where do you rank here? I don't want to know. Don't put it in the description below. But the rich list index, I've shown you this before. Let's say you have, I'm just going to throw a number out there, 15,000 XRP. You've, you purchased 15,000. This is going to generate 
and if you have 15,000 XRP, you are ranked 83,068. That means there are 83,067 accounts with more XRP, 42 accounts with the exact same amount, and 1.9 million accounts with less XRP. It's a reference point. And, and I like looking at it because it, it'll give you an idea of where you stand. And, you know, a lot of people get FOMO and they're like, oh my gosh, I don't have enough. You know, uh, how much is enough? I'm not a financial advisor. Whatever you're comfortable with, what, you know, don't get, don't have the fear of missing out. Don't spend your entire savings or your, your entire paycheck on XRP. Buy what you can. You know, the prices are going up today. It's almost, we're almost 27 cents right now. So, uh, BitTrue is one of my uh, exchanges that I use to purchase cryptocurrency besides XRP. They have a really good variety of different cryptocurrencies that aren't available on other exchanges. Uh, as a matter of fact, you can get VET or VeChain. And the reason I bring this up is because when you hold VeChain or VET on an exchange, you are going to accumulate VETO, which is the fuel token. And you have to have VETO in order to transfer VeChain. And what will happen is you'll start accumulating and accumulate. And if you've had VeChain or VET on an exchange for a while, you've accumulated quite a bit of the VETO token. So what I'm bringing to your attention here is that whenever you transfer your vet to another wallet you are going to be leaving some of the veto fuel on the exchange and i found out today believe it or not just today that you can transfer the veto fuel to your vet wallet i thought it was a separate wallet but no you can actually if you have say 50,000 V chain or vet and you send it to another wallet, you're going to have some veto left over. Just go in and send the veto to that vet wallet and it will all go to the same place. A little FYI. Okay. Coil. I haven't really talked much about coal. I have an account and the reason I have a coil account is because you can monetize web pages. You can monetize YouTube channels and coal costs five dollars a month and what it does it enables you to create a blog you can create they have a cinnamon video service which is like youtube and when other individuals or members of coal view your blog or view your cinnamon account you will get small increments of xrp this is called web monetization. This is webmonetization.org. And what this does, this shows you that coal is attached to the web monetization. I have the web monetization attached to Uphold. Uphold is an exchange, which is an excellent exchange. You need to check them out as well. But when individuals look at my YouTube videos or they go to my blog or they go to Cinnamon Video, if they have a coal account, I will start getting small increments of XRP. And every time these pages are viewed, it sends small increments to my Uphold USD account. And this goes through the ILP, the Interledger Protocol, XRPL, and it goes straight to my Uphold account. This is my coal blog, and it's kind of basic, and I haven't posted in a while, but I have several, you know, posts on here that I've talked about the about me and uh, what have I learned from the XRP community and how much cryptocurrency do I need to invest in. I actually need to go in and update this and put more blogs on here, but uh, look at it. Go to coal.com. Like I said, it's only $5 a month, and it, it's the reason I like it is because XRP is attached to it in the monetization process and as you know xrp is my number one investment so check it out let's go back to fiat leak real quick 26.4 xrp things are happening in the xrp community people are getting on board with cryptocurrency ever since the occ announced that banks can now custody cryptocurrency it's an exciting time to be here 
I've been investing for three years in cryptocurrency and right now things are starting to happen. So get excited. Do your research. I'm going to tell you in every video and especially if you're new to this space, do your research. You know, go into uh, Coin Paprika if you're looking at cryptocurrencies, coinpaprika.com and go in and click on each one of these top 100 or if you want to, you can go up here and search and actually search for a different crypto and they cover all of them so anyway nice little video a little fyi uh i hope everyone has a wonderful and safe weekend and we will see you soon take care